Hello, welcome to Biograd TV. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss our next video. Biography of Brigadier David Lansana Brigadier David Lansana served as a military attache to the United States after Sierra Leone became independent. He was also the first indigenous force commander of the Sierra Leone military during the colonial era. Lansana was born on the 22nd of March 1922 in Baima, Mandu Chiefdom, Kalaihon District, British Sierra Leone. He belonged to the Mende ethnic group, which was one of the two largest ethnic groups in Sierra Leone, the other being the Temne ethnic group. In 1947, Lansana enlisted as a private and began his training in the Sierra Leone army. He was the bearer of Sierra Leone's colors during the coronation of Queen Elizabeth II. He belonged to the few Sierra Leoneans who were educated at the Royal Military Academy at Sandhurst, Berkshire, United Kingdom during the colonial period. As a lieutenant, he frequented the home of Sir Robert de Zouch Hall, governor of Sierra Leone from 1952 to 1956. Lansana rose through the ranks in the army and when his friend, Prime Minister Albert Magai was in power, Brigadier Lansana took control of the army from British colonial advisor Brigadier R.D. Blackie. Magai championed a non-democratic one-party state at the time, and Northern and Creole officers were systematically purged from the armed forces as Lansana and Magai hailed from the Mende tribe. This triggered conflicts from the Northern tribes and the Creoles who were apparently dissatisfied with the insensitivity of the duel. On the 17th of March 1967, Magai was defeated in the general election. The All People's Congress APC, won 32 seats in parliament, while Magai's party got only 28 seats. Four days after, on the 21st of March, Lansana saw to the extrajudicial arrest of the new democratically elected Prime Minister, Siaka Steven. The arrest took place just before the announcement of the election results. Lansana then seized control of State House as well as the national radio and television channels and declared martial law in Sierra Leone. That was the first coup d'etat in the history of the Republic of Sierra Leone. The following day, on the 22nd of March 1967, Lansana made a second radio broadcast reiterating his declaration of martial law. Lansana's fellow Mende officers weren't in support of his moves as they believed he was using the army as a tool of internal government. On the 23rd of March 1967, Major Charles Blake and other senior military officers relieved Lansana of his command and established the National Reformation Council NRC that took control of the government. Also, Lansana and his sister-in-law, Paramount Chief Ella Koblo Gulama, who was a minister without portfolio in Magai's government, were arrested on charges of treason and detained at Pademba Road Prison. This was in line with their alleged conspiracy against former Prime Minister Albert Magai. The charges against Gulama could not be proven so she was released from prison after about 18 months. Lansana remained detained at Pademba Road Prison, Freetown, Sierra Leone. He was married to Kome Gulama Lansana, the daughter of Paramount Chief Julius Gulama of Kayemba Chiefdom and Madame Lucy Gulama. The Gulamas were Mende royalty and among the most important ruling families in Sierra Leone. His father-in-law was a founding member of the Sierra Leone People's Party, which was the first political party in the country. His sister-in-law was Paramount Chief Ella Koblo Gulama, and his brother-in-law was Paramount Chief Bai Koblo Pazbana II. Lansana and his wife had five children, Sheku, Judy, Tala, Fode, and Konya. Lansana also had a son, Daniel from another relationship. 
On the 19th of July, 1975, he was executed by hanging with former Minister of Finance, Mohamed Fona, Lieutenant Habib Lansana Kamara, Ibrahim Bashtaki, and Paramount Chief Bai Makari Nsilk. After the execution, their bodies were displayed for an hour. What have we missed out of this biography of Lansana? Let's know in the comment section. Will it be ridiculous to subscribe to our channel? If no, please like this video, share, and subscribe to our channel.